All right, that's feeling pretty good. As you guys know, I just got back from meeting Gary Player, and my big question was, how do I go from being a 70s shooter into the 60s? And you know what he told me? I have to be a great wedge player and become a master from 50 yards and in. So I'm gonna be making a few videos on this subject over the next couple of weeks. Now, first of all, with these wedge shots, I wanna tell you, I'm doing the Ben Hogan exercise where I keep my upper arms connected to my body. I'm really just rotating through the shot and that's giving me great solid and consistent contact so i highly recommend you give it a shot so enjoy this video and quick announcement the first msc intensive of 2020 is here in pasadena october 24th and 25th i've only got room for six people and i've already got half the spaces filled up so if you want to come hit me up christo at myswingevolution.com i hope you hit them long and hit them straight. So I watched a pretty cool video with uh, Colin Morikawa talking about how he hits wedges. And uh, he was talking about trying to not get too steep so he doesn't dig too much. And, uh, you know, I'm, I'm fascinated by you know, what the pros are doing, because when I talked to Gary Player, I asked him, how do I go from the 70s to the 60s? And he very quickly said, you must become a master of the game from 50 yards and in. You know, it's not a surprise to any of you guys that my short game and short wedges is where I have the most room to improve. But I think it just goes to show you, I mean, like, honest to God, that's where all the scoring really, really happens. So. Um, I've adopted this arm lock putting technique, which seems to be helping me a lot. But uh, I'm out here today warming up before the skins game, and I want to I want to get these wedges super crisp. You know, I mean, you know, I'm working on hundred yard wedge shots right now, but I just want to be able to get that crisp contact. And a key to it is for me to keep my arms connected, my upper arms connected, just like the famous Ben Hogan drill from the Ed Sullivan show. trying to stay stay cool it's about 100 degrees out here right now now guys if you like these videos please click subscribe hit a like leave a comment that stuff helps us out a lot and if you want to learn more about my swing evolution you can go to myswingevolution.com where i've got my top five swing secrets video available for free and i've got full length instructional videos that tell you how i rebuilt my swing guys golf shouldn't have to be so hard the problem is information overload there's so much info out there it's like trying to build a race car by going to a junkyard and grabbing spare parts off of every old clunker. It's just not gonna work. I wanted to have a great golf swing, so I narrowed my focus and just studied the swing of Ben Hogan. And guess what, it worked. Today I'm one of the best golfers at my club. My swing evolution has over 20 million views, and I even got to play Ben Hogan on the Golf Channel. So if you want to become a great ball striker, go to MySwingEvolution.com, pick up the MSE golf system, and start your swing evolution today. Hit them long and hit them straight.